With the help of the internet, you can pretty much do whatever you love right now and make a living out of it. And that is why I want to share with you what I learned from this book called Expert Secrets from Russell Brunson and how it has helped me, how I approach life, how I approach business, and how I turn my passion and abilities to do something into a business so that you can also do it for yourself. Coming up. in this book expert secrets I was already doing what I love before when I was still in university when I was still studying nursing I was already doing what I love which is playing guitar playing in the bands and playing to any sort of special events in, in our town in our province in our um, country and pretty much we can you know play whatever song we want whatever you know um, dress we want to and it's pretty like I was living in my dream and you know I was already making money out of it you know playing on stages playing on birthdays the booths, playing on weddings so when I came across this book you know just a couple of years ago this really like got my interest okay at that time I am just like making money you know doing what I love but how can I turn that passion of mine and turn it into a business? Because this book will really allow you to, you know, this is a map that will allow you to turn any specialized skills that you have, any abilities, any skills, any specialized knowledge that you have and turn it into a business that will work for you. When even though you are not here to build a business, but how can you monetize what you do so that you know you can keep doing that for the rest of your life and make money out of it? And that's what I'm gonna share with you and what I learned from this book. This book will simply change how I approach life, how I you know position myself when it comes to um, making a deal, negotiating a deal, making uh, videos for clients, and this is just like helped me a lot. But what I learned about this book is you really need to charge for your advice you know you really need to charge other people who wants to take your advice just for example if someone will come up to me and ask me like I know you've been doing videos on social media I know you've been doing um, photos and you know you create these amazing videos can you teach me or how can I do the same thing like what you're doing right now straight up I can just give all my knowledge to that person for free without any charge without you know because I am just simply passionate about sharing what I know but if I just do that straight although that person will you know get all the information but the problem is that person will not really take action of you know the information that he got from me why because it's just simply for free there's no value in exchange there's no commitment that he put out that you know he will tell me that he will do every single thing that i'll tell him what to do but what if 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 before i give him the advice i will let him commit with something or you know um have value in return and you know that's why you will know exactly who are the people that is really passionate or really interested of doing or you know really interested in changing their life or you know making the new version of them from the people who just want you know the information and even though some people will ask me okay can we collab or can we get a coffee or you know I can treat you a coffee like I don't waste my time if someone will invite me to go for a party then I just don't want to go to the party because I really value my time and if people want my advice I charge for them if people wants me to work for a project for them then I charge them straight ahead and you know that's how you can really make a business whatever you are passionate about and try to think about if I am expert in this thing how can these people then benefit from what I am good at and that's where you start charging people so that every time you do something there's a value exchange between both companies between you and the clients or between you and your friend so that's just how this book really helped me in expert secrets and how you can really position yourself in a way that you are the expert in that field for example you are really good at knitting okay you are really good at 
let's say making a website you're really good at editing photos you're really good at making visual effects so how can you let those clients how can you find those you know people who needs your service and charge them for what your value is worth not your time okay the value that you're bringing on the table because you don't charge per you know per hour you charge for the value that you put in because if you're an expert you, you can just like do it like in a short period of time so you know if you just charge for you know per hour then you lose a ton of it but if you charge for a value that you can bring on the table then that's how can you leverage and monetize what you know what you're passionate about and what are the things that you really want to do that can bring you happiness and can also impact other people's lives so that's basically what I learned from this book I already read this twice and I also have another book that is like okay what one sec so I have another book that is an open yet and yeah I still need to read this book and I still have one more to go so if you want to add knowledge in yourself just try to find the books that will inspire you that you know that books that will make you do something of what is it that you really want to do that that can make you get one step closer to your goal so you know I'm not a reader by far like since since I was in university, I don't read books. I just ask my classmates, you know, what are the things that I need to know? But as time goes by, as you know, I get mature, I get experience, then I learned that in order for you to get ahead, it's not to really experience everything, but to study what other people have gone through and, you know, to study the experience of, uh, you know, other successful people. And that's how you really gain knowledge that how that's how you can add more experience to whatever age you are even though you are still 18 even though you are 21 but if you know a lot of things if you know if you have a lot of knowledge in whatever field that you're in and you become expert at it age doesn't matter because you can add an experience a lesson knowledge in your life by just reading a book or just by watching other people's um, biography or other people's life story and that's how can you really leverage or that's how you can really separate you from other people who are doing the same thing as you are doing right now so i hope you learned something from this and if you do you know go read some books don't be lazy you can always have 30 minutes downtime then read the books thanks for watching ciao for now